Hi everyone, in this problem we're going to find the inverse of this function. So the first step when finding the inverse is to rename our function y. So y is equal to 1 over x. That's the very first step. The second step is to switch our x's and our y's. So we can write this as x equals uh, 1 over y. And the third step is usually the hardest step. It's to solve for y. So to do that, what we'll do is we'll clear the fractions. So I'm going to put a y here and put a y here. And so these cancel. So we get yx equals 1. And we're looking for y. It's being multiplied by x. So we'll just divide by x, divide by x. So we get y equals uh, 1 over x. And the fourth step, the fourth step is to just rename our function um, using the proper notation. So f inverse of x is equal to 1 over x. So we got the same answer as the original problem. So this happens sometimes. Functions can have their own inverses. And 1 over x is an example of that. It's called an idempotent function. I hope this video has been helpful.